American Business Environment. Hi, my name is Bill Carmody, and I'm excited today to talk to you about the factors that are driving the American business environment. And there are eight of such factors driving the American business environment. Number one is competition. The U.S. has a highly competitive business environment with a large number of domestic and international companies operating in various industries. Now, that might be counterintuitive. You might think, well, wait, I don't want a lot of competition. But in truth, that competition helps drive efficiency and effectiveness of every industry. So the more competitive it is, the easier it is for you to be able to carve out your niche and your slice of that growth. Number two is regulation. The U.S. business environment is heavily regulated by various federal, state, and local agencies to ensure fair competition, protect consumers, and maintain high standards for goods and services. Again, that might sound counterintuitive. Why would I want a highly regulated industry? And yet, here's what comes down to fair competition. There are places in the world where you could be working and building this amazing business, and suddenly the government swoops down and just takes it over and says, you can't run this business anymore. Or there's a giant monopoly that means you can't compete. Or you might find that they're not protecting consumers, and so essentially one of your competitors is giving you a bad name because you're giving the entire industry a bad name. So the idea of maintaining high standards through regulation means that there is a fair understanding between what a consumer buys and what they receive. Innovation. The U.S. is known for its culture of innovation and entrepreneurship, which drives business growth and development. The more we innovate together, it affects all of the people that are playing in that particular industry. And consumer demand. Consumer demand drives the U.S. economy and plays a major role in shaping business strategy and decision making. Because we have such high consumer demand, a lot of individuals can st start their own businesses and have a very effective growth strategy because they know that the de demand exists and they can tap into that demand to help grow their business. Number five, talent and workforce. A highly skilled and diverse workforce is crucial in the success of a U.S. business. And companies are constantly seeking to top talent to drive their operations. In other words, we want to have the best people working on our business. And if we have a highly diverse and skilled workforce, that means when you're set, establishing a business in the United States, you should be able to scale effectively by having the right people working on the right aspects of your business. Access to capital is number six. Access to capital, including venture capital, loans, equity funding, it's essential for business to grow and thrive. So when you need additional resources, specifically cash, to grow your business, you have it here. You have access to capital. It'll help you actually grow more effectively. Technology. The rapid pace of technology innovation has transformed the U.S. business landscape and continues to play a key role in shaping the future of commerce. So not to be taken lightly, having great technology behind you helps you ramp, helps you scale. And lastly, globalization. The U.S. is a major player in the global economy, and businesses must be able to adapt to the challenges and opportunities of international trade and commerce. We are well set up to create businesses here in the United States and then compete globally. So we know that you can start your business anywhere. These are the main eight factors as to why you would want to start your business here in the United States. And so again, I'm biased because I'm here in the United States and I've built and exited many multi-million dollar marketing agencies. And at the same time, what I would love to share with you is, is that there are more and more solopreneurs, uh, million dollar one person businesses. And a lot of that is because of all these factors we just discussed. And ultimately what it comes down to when you're thinking about your business environment is, are you planting your company seed in the most fertile soil? The United States has a lot of really great fertile soil, and I think it would be a great place for you to consider when establishing your business.